September will mark the 10 year anniversary of IMUS on MSNBC. And it's been, well, shall we say, an adventure. Take a look at this. For you folks watching on MSNBC, this would be our um, debut morning. And uh, in looking at uh, some of the promos they've been running over the past uh, suck. weeks and stuff, they don't suck. Well, they're not that great. But uh, it was unclear to me exactly what. I mean, if I didn't know who I was and what this was all about, it was unclear what this was going to be. So essentially what you'll be watching is a radio program with uh, little or no um, juggling uh, no. television consideration. <laughs> well, here's what we've discovered already with this whole uh, MSNBC affair. Okay, break it down for us, Bob. Is that it is very disconcerting when they cut away, if you're in the middle of talking to Mike Wallace or Jeff Greenfield. Right. Have you seen the commercials on MSNBC? It's embarrassing. They have these, they, it's all per inquiry deals, which means boys and girls, that they have these, they sell these record packages and hemorrhoid ointment, and you call a 1 800 number, and for every call they get, then the, then the, the client pays a certain amount of money. So, I mean, they, they, have, they, they, have, they have no commercials, and the ones they have are stupid. Well, I have a copy here of Peter Johnson's Inside TV column in this morning's edition of uh, USA Today, yeah. and uh, he is suggesting that MSNBC's best-rated show is possibly this one, <laughs> which is oh, really man. pathetic. What does that say that's about pathetic. MSNBC? Jesus, I God, I mean, that's just painful. You know, stop it. Just, just pull the plug now. Well, I'm so torqued off at MSNBC because... Uh, What's the matter? Well, here's what they do. They went to a break here at 43 minutes past the hour. Yeah. Now, I was watching MSNBC yesterday right. in the afternoon. Uh, and they, and at, at that break, they, which they claim is locked in by whatever, they because of their com computer, computer or whatever yeah. it is. Computer driven, yeah. They went to the 43 break at about 44.30. Okay. So it's clear that they didn't have to go. So the, so what they did was they cut off the end of Paul Harvey. That's annoying. And which is annoying for people who are watching television. When, when apparently, your judgment is that they do have some float built in there Absolutely somewhere. Absolutely they do. And they're lying weasels when they claim they don't. <laughs> Here we go. Well, you know, so. you want me to put this heavy-duty uh, Fred Imus Autobot Express t over that camera? Just drape it over the camera. Would you, right. they'll there just, you go. There now you what? Go. Well, now they just switched to another camera. Well, I'll, I'll, ch I'll chase around this room. I'll <laughs> keep up with it. Let's put T-shirts over all the cameras. The ratings will go up, probably. Ah, I got him. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Lou, pop in Cronkite. I need to go take it. And uh, switch these sets around. Because uh, uh, MSNBC hates it when Charles and I leave the studio. Gotta. Because uh, Andrew Lack, who I actually sort of like, he was whining about... Uh, he didn't think it was good television to take pictures of an empty studio. <laughs> Boy, you can't get anything by him, can you? No, we don't care. I, I absolutely don't care. Well, we just got off the phone. Charles did with this moron from MSNBC, right? Yes, sir. And they're playing. Just, uh, just turn your televisions off. That's my recommendation. Just turn them off. <laughs> well, now, wait a minute. Let's not take a pessimistic view here, I man. Well, I mean, it's just... <laughs> they've got to decide what they want to do. They're just morons. Let me tell you how stupid they are at MSNBC. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. As if you have to, but go ahead. Oh, yeah, but it's just <laughs> although I have to. Mm -hmm. They have Tom Brokaw and... Uh, Katie Couric or Jane Pauley. Now they're on MSNBC, all right, and they're doing a promo, and they're the promo's fine, and they're looking at the camera and they're saying, MSNBC, it's time to get connected. Mm. Well, if you are watching <laughs> MSNBC and Tom Brokaw is telling you, you're already connected. <laughs> Hello, Mumbles. Hello, you're already connected. <laughs> Run the ad on CNN <laughs> or, or, or CBS. <laughs> How does that make any sense? Zero. God <laughs> almighty. It's time to get connected. And, and I'm screaming. <laughs> I'm already connected, you idiot. Here's the ad they ran in the, in the uh, New York Times. And you notice at the top of the ad, there's Tom Brokaw, Jane Pauley, that little wuss, Matt Lauer, Jane Pauley, Fat Al, and uh, Brian Williams. Katie those, Couric, yeah. Or Katie Couric, yeah. Oh, okay, those are the heavyweights. Mm -hmm. Now, unfortunately, we go down to the bottom here. And the loser And rank. we have the loser list of loser lineup. Mm -hmm. People like Stone Phillips, Ann Curry, John Hockenberry, Soledad O'Brien, 
that jerk who did a suck-up interview with uh, O.J. Simpson, the fat chick, and the eye man. Dead last, Dead yeah. last lower, loser, loser list. Loser, loser row, lower right-hand corner. I mean, not not only is it humiliating, first of all, they are paying more to run this program on MSNBC than they pay all of these people combined. You know, they're trying way too hard to be hip, and they're not, and they're, and they're stupid. And it's irritating. It's insulting. And you're dead last in the loser and, list. And, and where am I? Where am I? <laughs> Down here, way over on the right with these losers. <laughs> what I can do, they can't prevent me from doing this, what? I want you to put uh, tape up over all of the cameras this morning. <laughs> I, I will not appear on, the, no. on their thing anymore. So tape the cameras over. I will not appear. Yeah. Have somebody come in and put uh, cardboard or something over the cameras. Right over it. I, will, I don't want to be on their How about we put a fugly, ugly, stupid... Uh, we make little signs and, and leave the cameras on. Make little signs. Obscene NBC signs. NBC sucks. Yeah. The CBS rules. You know, ABC yeah. rules. Yeah. Andy Andy Lack. Lack. CNN. <laughs> and and it it up. Signs and it up. I'm going to do that now. I'm going to make a little What's this sitting there, man? Hold on, I mean, yeah, they do. They suck the big, the big hairy one.